It is gorgeous out today. It's October 30th and it's been rainy and cold and icky and I've been dying to get out here to start playing with my garden beds so they can be prepped and ready for planting in the spring. I've got this little third acre property and we grow a ton of food on it. These are our oldest vegetable beds. Just have a tiny third acre of chickens. They've really prepped this soil. That's going to turn into something later. Probably next spring we'll turn it into more beds. These are old beds too, the ones in the very back where you see the, the kale still thriving. But in the front, we just added these. And we used a permaculture technique that takes the sod from our pathway and just we flip it over and put it right on top of the grass so that we've got this built up bed kind of a raised bed that is great for this particular environment because it's so soggy in the spring we've trenched around it filled it with pea gravel and it serves a couple of purposes the pea gravel is a pathway and it's a storage system for all the excess rainwater that helps to keep the roots of our vegetables nice and moist. You can see we began to put a little straw on top of this, not nearly enough, but as the leaves fall from the trees, we're gonna grind it up with our electric lawn mower and start to sheet mulch these beds. This is uh, grass clippings, any organic matter that we can pile on top of this will decay over the winter time it will encourage earthworms so that the castings the poop from the earthworms help to build up the soil the earthworms eat all of this yumminess it's just grass clippings and as we add some nice brown leaves it begins becomes more and more rich and awesome I'll show you what i mean these older beds are pretty mature. We've been here about four years and, and these have been worked a lot. So the, the soil is so loamy and awesome. And this bed just needs a little mulch on it to protect it from the winter to encourage more earthworms. When the soil warms up in the spring, we can start putting some little baby vegetable plants into them. And it's pretty outstanding.